So basically, when I was uh, very young, all my life, I sort of always made books and always made things in general. And I never really realized until I was kind of 18 that there was an actual profession for that. And illustration, I started it, and then I realized sort of half a year into it that it's literally everything I've ever done. And so now I'm just very happy just making books all the time. So I looked around at different courses, like all around London and everything. I went in and it felt very much um, a little cold and industrial compared. On this course, I just felt like I could relate to the people who were sort of talking about it. And um, they sort of had the same mindset as I did about how illustration is. And they give you more freedom about your own style as well. Everyone's friendly, so that's good. Um, I'd say that there's plenty of space because I think we only had about 20 on our course. That meant that we got constant feedback for everything we did. Like you can just go and email your tutor, what do you think of this? And they'll always get back to you. <laughs> when I first started, I sort of saw illustration as like the same really, but I didn't really understand it as well as I do now, which is a bit strange because I saw it as sort of character design, making books. Um, but I was pretty naive like to all the processes that you can do to make it look better, for example, like using a computer, Photoshop, to edit the images, make it into a big layout that looks good. I think before I started, I had no idea about any of that. No Photoshop, no InDesign, nothing. <laughs> so um, yeah, I learned everything here basically for that. So before I came here, I could draw. Um, I had an imagination for characters and then on the course I basically learned how to use that to apply it to books properly in the real world. So I would, I would definitely tell past Abigail and anyone starting illustration to not expect it to just be drawing because I'm just starting to get into the serious side of it with like contracts and taxes and everything else. Um, yeah, there's so much more to it, and I feel like most of my job isn't going to be art, even though that would be amazing. <laughs> but um, I think that's it, really. Just be prepared for running a business, because that's what it is in real life. Um, but yeah, try and keep the heart in it, otherwise it's just going to go cold. I think if I had known it when I started, it wouldn't be as soulful, because I would have been thinking more like a business. So, yeah. Keep a balance. <laughs>